Myelofibrosis, or MF, is a cancer of the bone marrow that results in scarring of the, bone marrow, of the marrow tissue, which often leads to cytopenias, particularly thrombocytopenia anemia, and can lead to weakness, fatigue, and large spleen and liver. Severe thrombocytopenia, defined as a blood platelet that, that count below 50 times 10 to the 9, occurs in one-third of the overall MF population and has a particularly poor prognosis with an overall survival of just 15 months. For many years, Jacophy or ruxolitinib, has been the mainstay of MF care. However, despite its extensive use, the majority of treated patients are receiving low subtherapeutic doses of Jacophy, predominantly due to myelosuppression from the drug. Fonjo has a profile that differentiates it from other JAK inhibitors. First, it is a novel JAK2 and IRAC1 inhibitor, the latter being an emerging target in the treatment of MF. Second, unlike Jackify, Fonjo does not inhibit JAK1, and an important differentiator, as JAK1 inhibition is believed to be a cause of drug-related myelosuppression. Fondro was granted accelerated approval by the FDA for the treatment of adults with intermediate or high-risk primary or secondary myelofibrosis with a platelet count below 50 times 10 to the 9. The NDA supporting the Fondro approval was reviewed under priority view by the FDA. It's based on the data from the Phase 3 Persist 2 study and includes safety data on patients with platelet counts less than or equal to 100 times 10 to the 9. Importantly, unlike other JAK inhibitors, the Vonjo product label does not include a black box safety warning, nor was a REMS program required by the FDA. The adverse event data in the product label includes all patients from the PERSIST-2 trial who were treated with Vonjo 200 milligrams twice daily in patients with platelet counts up to and including 100 times 10 to 9 per liter. In this population, nearly half the patients had a platelet count of below 50 times 10 to the 9, the, equil the equivalent of at least grade 3 thrombocytopenia, and the median baseline hemoglobin was 9.5 grams per deciliter. The most common adverse reactions were diarrhea, thrombocytopenia, nausea, anemia, and peripheral edema. It is important to note that similar to other JAK inhibitors used to treat MF, the prescribing information for Vonjo also contains what FDA has described as class labeling for JAK inhibitors, that is, warning language for major, major cardiac events, thrombosis, secondary malignancies, and risk of infections. These warnings were not a result of any particular finding during FDA, the FDA's review of the Vonjo NDA, but rather reflect safety concerns that have risen when other JAK inhibitors are used to treat rheumatoid arthritis, as announced by the FDA in their safety bulletin in September of last year.